What is going on everybody? My name is Billy and welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are all doing well. Sorry for the lack of videos on this channel. I have not been as consistent. I'm in the process of getting a new computer so I am not able to record as much because this computer doesn't really work as well. Yeah, I also want to just thank you guys so much for the support lately. You guys are just absolutely wonderful. I love the um, feedback that you guys have been giving me in the last few videos I've done. So thank you so much for just you know, being a part of my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, welcome, have a seat, come along. Um, th this this is a place of fun, joy, and craziness. So <laughs> yeah, uh, you'll get it all here on this channel. Um, anyway, in today's video, I'm going to be watching a Dimash performance that you guys wanted me to see. The song Dimash is going to sing is called Chuno Brimzai. Um, at least that's what it translates to. I'm not really sure. Um, the last performance I saw of Dimash absolutely broke me. I was in tears. Your Love was such a great song. And yeah, I really hope I'm not going to be emotional mess like I was in the last video. I, I don't want to be crying all the time. I want to be happy. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know half the time. Dimash just makes me feel in many ways um, great, happy, emotional, and all the above. Like, I, I don't know what to feel when I listen to him. The original link to this video will be in the description below. If you want to check out this video without me interrupting, I don't know if I will be able to show the full video, but I'll just have to see. Um, and uh, yeah, guys, let's just get into it. All right, let's get into this in three, two, one, play. Okay. Here we go. One of my favorite in the for us. Okay. Oh my, here we go. This is exciting. <laughs> He's still in red. I, I like it. He is like a rose, I must say. Oh. Oh my god, yes. Oh, I love that sound. Oh, that control. Oh. Chills. <laughs> No, this is sad. Oh, <laughs> I feel it. Oh my god. This just sounds so beautiful. Oh. My soul. I'm sorry. I will sing it though. Oh, the... oh it's angels. Oh my god. Oh. 
I'm with you. I feel the same. This <laughs> is so beautiful. Yes. Was this a like? Was this song in tribute to that lady? I think it. I think it was. It, it looked like it. This must have been a tribute song. Oh my god! Wow! Wow! Oh my goodness! Get me in the fields again. This field train. Oh. Can we? Can we just like? chill with the feels okay i need oh i need something what an emotional song that was god i wasn't ready for that either jeez um people i was touched that was so beautiful um what a feeling uh, wow um i feel sad <laughs> I feel sad now um I also feel happy as well uh that was just very it was very powerful very beautiful oh god I'm getting emotional again I don't know what it was about that song but I felt every word I felt the the power and the beauty of it um through his voice as I do, I do connect. I connect to Dimash's voice on a very personal level. It does get to my heart. Um, yeah, I don't know. Was this a tribute song to someone? Because um, it was the camera was pointing to that lady. I'm thinking maybe this song was dedicated to her. I don't really know. Feel free to let me know what this song meant. When I watch these performances, I don't always know the context of the performance. I don't know what most of the song means because I don't know the language. Um, I know that does frustrate some people. I love the fact that many of you take the time to explain to me what most of the songs mean and what the message is behind them. Like lately, you guys have been giving me a lot of feedback on what uh, performance, you know, it either means and what, you know, basically the context. And I'm sorry that I don't know everything about the song. I enjoy it for what it is and I I feel it emotionally myself. Like it's the toning, it's the sound, it's the like the raw emotion that I get when I see these performances like from any artist. I'm very passionate about music. I love the feeling that it gives me and I do get into a massive mess of emotion when it comes to listening to songs and stuff and I know some of you don't like the fact that I'm very over the top and I'm I'm sorry. I, I express myself very openly. If being emotional means I'm crazy then hey it's a crazy world people. It's a crazy world. Chunor, Brivzai and Your Love. Out of those two I would go for Your Love. Um, because I feel like Your Love had so much more to it with Dimash's performing. Like, I really felt more... Um, I'm just a sucker for the high notes for me. I, I love it when it goes really high. It gets me excited. It gives me the adrenaline. I get emotional and I just... I love every moment of it. It's just amazing the talent this man has and the love that he gives. I love how passionate he is for what he does. I, for one look forward to seeing more of his performances if youtube does not strike me down beforehand thank you for requesting this to me this was a very beautiful piece and i i treasure i treasure all of dimash's performances all the videos i've seen and reacted to of him i treasure them um because for me it's a moment in time where i felt more when i got to listen to a performance that was so different. I remember the first time when I watched Dimash, I I was stunned. I, I never saw something like that. I never heard anything like that. Just someone's voice with the amount of power. I've come a long way since my first day of reacting to Dimash. Like, let's just say I've come a long way. It's been years and I am... 
I still feel it to this day. I still feel and I still get emotional over his music. And that's how beautiful it is. If you can still get emotional after, what, two, three years, then, hey, it's great. It's always great. Dimash has never disappointed me. In all his time of all the performances I've seen, he has never disappointed. Um, I would say his weakest performance was when he did Uptown Funk because it wasn't really him. That was the only performance that I remember being not the best. I liked it, but it just wasn't as up there as his other performances has been. But he has improved massively over the years. And he really took me out of a dark place. When I first listened to Dimash, I was in, I was in depression. I was in a very sad state in my life and his music really lifted me up. He gave me the strength to go on. Mental health is far more widespread now. Like everyone's talking about mental health, which is really good. Um, if you're going through a hard time in your life, make sure to just, you know, talk to someone, you know, make your situation known. Don't, don't feel like you have to stay in the dark because you are not alone in all of this. It's tough. It's tough out there. And I do hope everyone is still staying safe and taking care through these times. If you guys haven't seen my other reactions to the mash, I have a whole playlist from basically where I began and where I am now of Dimash. I might just leave a link to the playlist in the description to make it easier for you guys so you guys can just find like the reactions if you want to of course it's up to you. I don't know if I will be uploading for a little while after this um, because I am getting a new computer. I'm waiting for it so I'm gonna probably have a new system when when I make my next video. So yeah, that's basically all from me guys. I hope you all have a wonderful, fantastic day. And my name is Billy and Billy is now out. Take care guys. Bye.